Hello, Greg from Balloon Market here and welcome to BMTV. And as you can see, we are once again joined by a first time guest, Mr. Chris Smalley from Bell Bell. Chris, hello. Hi, Greg. How are you? I'm all right. How are you doing? Yeah, good. Thanks for having me here. Good. My pleasure. It's always great to have new guests on BMTV. Now, we'll, we'll come to talk about Bell Bell in a little bit and some of the products. But what I like to do with most people, well, everybody that comes on BMTV for the first time is find out a little bit more about you and, and you get to tell everybody your story. So do you want to share that with everybody? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I'm obviously, we go back a little way anyway, because we, we do some time ago. You were the very first person we bought balloons from. So yeah. when we started the business 18 years ago in our, in our conservatory, it was in Southampton, in our little house that we lived in at the time. And you sat in that conservatory and we placed our very first order so mm. with, with, with you. So how do you believe it wasn't for you, we wouldn't be here. <laughs> and how things have changed, nice of you to say, but how things have changed and here we are. They have changed a little bit, yeah. Um, here we are today. So um, yeah, I joined the balloon industry in 1997. So 25 years ago next year, in 22. How can 1997 be 20 something years ago? Oh, it's incredible how fast the time has gone. Yeah. Um, uh, in that time, I've worked for two or three different manufacturers, um, met a number of the customers out there, um, and um, seen a lot of change, I yeah. suppose, in, in that time. Uh, time yeah. has absolutely flown past. Yeah, and you've been with Bell Bell for how long now? I've been with Bell Bell just over a year. Okay. Um, and um, I'm looking after Bell Bell's uh, interests in the UK, um, getting out there, meeting the customers, talking about the products, um, a full range of latex balloons that are manufactured yeah. by Bell Bell in yeah. Poland. Well, you, Bell Bell, we stock three brands of latex, as you know, Bell Bell being one of them. But Bell Bell, mm. surprisingly, for a lot of people out there, um, is the one that we have stocked the longest. We have been selling Bell Bell balloons longer than we've been selling Qualitex or Sempertex, and they are great balloons. That's why we've been selling them for so long. But do you want to tell us a little bit more about Bell Bell as a company? Yeah, Bell Bell's been around for about 35 years now, um, manufacturing uh, a base in Poland. Yeah. Um, and uh, I guess that makes Bell Bell the local balloon manufacturer, yeah, if you like, way, compared yeah, yeah. to where some others are yeah. um, around the world. Um, range, a good, good range of decorator balloons, uh, normal quality, printer quality balloons, retail balloons. Um, we do uh, printing, all our own printing in house as well. Yeah, yeah. Um, manufacturing and printing millions of balloons every single week. Yeah. Um, and uh, supplying across Europe, across the world. Yeah, um, fantastic. And it's a, it's a business been there for some time. I think the, the fact that you've stocked the Bell Bell balloon for so long shows the, the quality and the longevity of the product. I, I mean, the reason we, we stocked Bell Bell balloons almost right from the very beginning was because we were doing balloon printing mm -hmm. and a lot of that printing was done on bell bow balloons and yeah. bell bow balloons were ideal for for printing because of their quality yeah and i don't know if people understand the whole printing process but you inflate a balloon in most cases there are some machines now that you just stretch the balloon but you inflate the balloon print on it and it, it takes a, a bit of a bashing really doesn't it yeah i think it has to be a substantial enough balloon to to go through the printing process yeah. and and still inflate to a good size and quality at the, at the end of it yeah uh, which is why it's been the, the printer's choice really yeah and we were we were doing the printing and then we were getting people asking us oh can we have some plain balloons to go with the printed balloons and it was like it just made sense to carry on with with bell bell balloons absolutely so. and, and the bell bell range um is printed as you can imagine on a bell bell balloon and so it matches in color wise yeah. Yeah. Uh, for anyone that's making bouquets or anything like that. Yeah, it was perfect. So let's talk about some of the range. Let's talk about some of the, the, the products that we've got here. Okay, well, um, Bell Bell manufacture balloons from five inch mm -hmm. um, all the way up to three foot and different sizes uh, within that as well. Yeah. Um, and within that, there are diff different uh, finishes of balloons as well. From the pastel, which is your standard uh, color balloon, yeah, yeah. Um, uh, if you like. Uh, crystal, which is a transparent balloon, yep. um, and then metallic balloon, which you know, I guess the answer, the answer is in the question. Yeah, it's, yeah. A, it's a metallic finish to the balloon, yeah. and then the new glossy balloon, which was introduced last year, which, which is, is a super shiny, very balloon. metallic, yeah, uh, very yeah. Good balloon. Okay, cool. and so they've been extremely popular. Yeah, yeah. So we've got some of the products here. We've got. I mean, we don't really need to go into codes and stuff, but mm -hmm. we be one hundred fives and all of that, but. Um, we've got some, these are 12 inch here, aren't they? Yep. And these ones here are five, in, five inch. Yep. yep. And 12 inch and five inch that are represented here on, uh, on the table in different colors and yeah. mixes. So what's the difference? Obviously the, the Bell Bell, the standard Bell Bell balloons we've been selling mm -hmm. and buying for years yep. are slightly different to the decorator range, aren't they? And we've only just 
recently introduced the decorator range. Do you want uh, to tell us more uh, about the difference? Absolutely. So uh, the, the standard range is still a, a great quality balloon. Uh, you've been selling it for years. Absolutely. I imagine you'll continue to sell it for years. Yeah. Um, and it's designed to work in, and perform well in the marketplace, whether it's with a printer um, or whether it's with a, uh, you know, a retailer. Yeah. Um, the D11, which is the new balloon that you refer to, which you're, yeah. you're now stocking, is one that's been pretty much designed by decorators for decorators. Yeah. Um, so it has different qualities to uh, the normal B105. Okay. Um, I have one here, which is a uninflated one. One you prepared earlier. Um, yes, indeed. So um, it, it will inflate to a, a, a con consistent rounder shape. Yeah. Um, and I think that the, the two other key things are about it is the, how long and stretchy the neck, neck is, yeah. which is a key thing, of course, for, for decorators. Yeah. Yeah. And it's got great helium retention yeah. as well. So, you know, if you've got a display that needs to last some time, it will do that. It's not there as a replacement to the B105, but it's there to enhance the range and uh, have a credible decorator. Balloon. I mean, we, we have customers that decorate all the time with mm -hmm. the B105s. Absolutely. Uh, and yeah. they're good quality balloons. They're slightly less expensive than the D11s, which is yeah. also yeah. beneficial. And that's one of the reasons that some people might, might like to decorate with them. But the D11, the ones I've, I've used, not that I use very many, but you can definitely feel the difference. Yeah, you can feel the difference. And uh, like, like the rest of the Bell Bell uh, balloons, they're, they're available in packs of 50, packs of 100, or the D5, which is the five inch decorator balloon, they yeah. come in bags of 100. And there's, there's that's, that that's, that's D5, yeah. isn't it? Right. That is a D5 there. That's a nice color as well. What's that color? Um, that one is the Kiwi Cream. I've not got my glasses on, so um. thank you for that. Um. <laughs> that's the Kiwi Cream, but again, it comes in a full range of colors from the, the Bell Bell color chart. Yeah. Um, every color that we do um, is available um, across the D11 and the D5. Yeah. Um, and, um, you know, we continue to develop those ranges and we'll be adding into them. So you're continuing to develop the ranges. What's, mm -hmm. What does the future hold? Can you tell me? Have you got any secrets? Um, yeah. So I think, you know, going forward, it's about what new colors are, there will be for, for 2022. Okay. Or this year, should I yeah. say, now that we're in 22. <laughs> um, and um, we've got, uh, we're trying to be fashion led and make sure that we're, we're leading from the front. So we've got some new seasonal colors that are coming through. Um, and in terms of the glossy balloons, uh, we're bringing uh, an anthracite, a copper, a wild rose. What colour is and lime, gri lime green. It's like a coal -y type colour. All right, okay. Um, so oh, gosh, it's, yeah. uh, you know, a lot of earthy colours are, uh, are, are very much on trend. And so we, we like to be sort of leading from the front in, yeah, terms, yeah. in terms of that. Uh, for pastel, we have uh, an alabaster balloon, wild rose and lime green coming into that range too. Okay. Um, and then, of course, we have a wider range. We have our printed balloons as well. So we're ha adding some happy birthdays, some new printed uh, designs that will go in with, the, you know, to make bouquets with florals yeah, yeah. and things like that. Um, and of course, for this year, being the World Cup, um, we're uh, introducing the whole range of uh, country flags on balloons. Yeah. Oh, fantastic. Um, okay. Um, to go with those They as will well. be popular. Yeah. Um, so I remember when we introduced, I think it was, was it last year? It might even have been the year before. And all the printed balloons and the uh, the six packs mm -hmm. they were so popular a lot of them are just absolutely fun. I think there was a football design in that as yeah. well I think uh, a lot of the obviously the prints have got the flags on but they're all done in the, in the correct colors and yeah. things as well yeah. and of course then you know from, from your customer's perspective they can put the 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 printed balloon with the colors as well yeah and the good thing is that the retail packs they are retail packs mm -hmm. designed to be sold in yeah. retail stores absolutely but if you are a decorator and somebody just wants you know, something that takes a few balloons, say a bouquet of three or four or something, and you just want a couple of those to be the printed balloons. You can get a six pack rather Absolutely. than, yeah. a, a, you know, a 50 yeah. pack or yeah. a 100 pack. Yeah, so. you don't have to buy in huge volumes to yeah. get the, 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 the balloon that you want. Talking of the retail packaging, uh, Bell Bar moving towards a plastic free packaging. Uh, oh, right, for, okay. Uh, later this year. It'll be introduced on a rolling change, um, but the plan is to, rem to change our retail uh, bags away from plastic packaging because of all the connotations that uh, yeah that, that at the that, moment. that's good in this day and age so what's it going to be is it going to be paper cards sort it of? will be a card paper stroke card fantastic well chris that is a really good introduction to the bell bell range so thank you so much for that now as a guest on bmtv you get to ask the question of the week right okay so but do you have a question of the week for everybody out there Okay, not balloon rate related uh, specifically okay, this one, fine. but uh, I travel the country a lot um, uh, in my role. I'm based in Pembrokeshire near Tenby, a little village called Manabir in southwest Wales. Okay. Uh, and I've traveled here from there today and will be returning later on. How many miles is it from Manabir in, in Pembrokeshire 
down to sunny Southampton. All right, a bit of a quizzy question mm -hmm. there, everybody. So how many miles is it from? Manabir. I, I, yeah. <laughs> in Pembrokeshire. To here. Totten in Southampton, mm -hmm. here where, where we are at Balloon Market. So Chris, thank you again. Thanks so much. Thank you very much for having me, Greg. And thank you, everybody out there for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you've not subscribed, please do hit subscribe on YouTube. Hit the little bell icon as well, and that way you'll be notified every time we upload a new show. And whilst you're there, Check us out on Instagram as well. Right, stay safe, stay happy. See you next time. Bye. Bye.